is about uh, business, how you can do business with network marketing, how to build your teams, how to build your teams with network marketing. So this, this is really going to help you guys because uh, <clears throat> today what the topic is very interesting, how you can build your network marketing business in 90 days. And for all the previous sessions, you want to, you can, uh, I just show it to you. You can just log on to our uh, WFIC Academy <coughs> channel on YouTube. And you will find on all the information. BFS Academy, please uh, like, share, and subscribe to this channel. See all the sessions which have happened uh, earlier. Uh, these sessions were taken by Mr. Deva Mesa, who is a, a great uh, leader, great uh, crypto trader. He, he, he deals with crypto and uh, Forex. He is a network marketer as well. He has uh, got a very good uh, base of uh, clients who, whom he teaches how he can, how they may, how to make money online. Okay, so he is uh, into trading, he's into crypto. And he's a great uh, global uh, trainer as well as speaker. So let me welcome him. Uh, Mr. Deva, a very warm welcome. How are you today, sir? Good afternoon, everybody. I was just searching for the mic to get it unmuted. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you. I hope everybody's good uh, on this Saturday. Your voice is, I think, a lot clearer. Can you hear me? I'm audible. I'm audible. Yeah. All right. So I think let's let's get started. So Devo, and what do we have for us today? Let's 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 get us through. Thank you. All right. Okay. So uh, thank you all for taking this Saturday. Uh, I don't know which time zone are you in. If it's morning, noon, afternoon, or evening. And my time is 2 p.m. So, uh, okay, uh, let me just check everything. Do I have everything in order? Okay, yes, I do. Wait one second. Okay, so uh, thank you everybody for being today with us. Uh, let us know where you are uh, logging in from, which area, which country. Uh, today's topic is going to be really interesting because we are going to talk about how to build your business in the 90 days, all right? So uh, with the BFIC Academy, we've been talking about, uh, as Jahangir said, the cryptocurrencies, the trading, uh, and also we are talking about one very important or important skill, which Robert Kiyosaki said that it's the number one skill in your life that you need in order to make money, and that is how to learn how to sell. OK, so <clears throat> sales, I've been 20 years in sales and it's been really uh, sales is an art. OK, so once I started in, in sales, uh, I, I didn't want to start in sales. So uh, I ended up in sales because I want to create something more. And my first touch with sales was my mom took me for a seminar. All right. So. Before, uh, like 20 years ago, there was no Zoom calls. There was no online calls. You had to go to a live seminar to attend and learn something about the particular company or topic. So once I was sitting there and I had 19 years and I was sitting there and listening to a guy speaking about life insurance. Okay? So he was speaking about life insurance, how people can save money and how you can make money you know, by selling that life insurance. So I got really interested in, uh, from, from that interest, I, I started calculating, okay, if this guy is talking what is right, I need this amount of sales to buy my first car. I was 19 years old. I was not having a car, right? So uh, we are connecting this with the previous topic, which we had on, on business. Uh, you can watch it on YouTube channel. And it is about how to create your why, right? So we spoke about last time, let me find out where is it, okay? We spoke about, uh, let's find, okay, here it is, right? So we spoke about last time about having your why, right guys? I know where is it, right? Okay, all right. Okay, so uh, we spoke about why and then getting to how, okay? So 
the, the most important thing, also we spoke about the contact list and how to build it, but let me get back to the topic. The first and main reason is your why, right? So you can watch that in previous training, which we did on leadership in sales and business, right? So <clears throat> I was having my why, and my why was buying at the time, it was 19 years ago, uh, uh, at that part, at that time, my why was actually a buying a Honda Civic 1996 black, right? So it, it need to have alloy rims, 15 inch and stuff like that. So I particularly knew what I want to buy, what I want to, to, to acquire for myself. So from there on, I just needed to know how to get it, right? And at the right time, my mother said, hey, why don't you come with me to a seminar and I'll show you how to make money for that car. Because I told her, hey, this is the car I want to buy. This is my first, my dream car that I want to buy that is, you know, accessible for me to buy in maybe a year or two. If I find a vehicle, how will I make this money, right? So I know my why, and then I need to find my how. And how is this platform that you're a part of, right? So you need to find your why within yourself, in your heart, in your head. We spoke about this last time in the training, building your goals. So I knew the vehicle, okay? So I had to learn about the compensation plan, how will I get paid, how much, uh, how much sales I need to make. And the best thing I need to learn is how to sell it to somebody, right? So... In that area, in, in, in where I was coming from, it was like you're a very closed-minded area. And I was a 19-year-old kid, and I was selling a savings, like life, life insurance, that is a savings, to a people who are 40, 50 years age. So I was coming always to an obstacle. So I had an obstacle because older, more experienced people did not want to listen a young kid who is talking to them about finance and teaching them something about finance. So there was a big uh, bump on the road, which I needed to cross. Many people right now, and, and probably maybe you're one of them, and asking yourself, is this the right thing for me? Uh, maybe some people quit in your, in your business because they, they stumble on the bump on the road, right? So if you're driving a car and you have your goal where you want to go, and you stumble on, let's say, you have a tree on your way, right? So there, there has been a storm and tree is on your way. What are you going to do? If, you, if this is the only road to your goal, either you're going to go around it, right? Find a way to go around it or move it, right? But you're not changing your goal. You're going there in some direction you have created for yourself. So at that point, I was a guy, a kid, 19 years old, not knowing how to sell, not knowing about the business. So I need to learn the skill. And also, uh, I was out of focus, right? So I need to learn how, how to do it, how to create it. So I needed to start to change myself. And trust me, that goal for me was so strong that any obstacle out of people who are making rejections was nothing for me, right? So rejections are mainly the first part where most of people quit in the business. They quit because here's why. You know your friends, right? You have your circle of friends. And what do you do? First time you get to hear about some business or opportunity, what do you do? You go to them like happy. Hey, I have a way how we can make money. I have a way how you can make money. I have a way how you can get out of that situation. I have a way how you can buy their car. I have a way how you can school your kids. And, and, and like anything they've been speaking about you, you know, you know, your intimate, their intimate uh, goals or, 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 or problems or, or stuff they're worrying about. And once you come there and they say, Ah, yeah, if that was so easy, everybody would do it. If that was so easy, everybody would make money. If that was so easy, easy why, are not you, why are you not millionaire already? You cannot become a millionaire. You cannot become wealthy overnight. That doesn't happen. Like people do not understand. 
So this is the first part where people get rejected and then they quit, right? So I, in, 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 my, in my business, in my career of network marketing, I had one, this, this was like one of the first books that I read. Uh, it's in my language. It's the book by John Furman, right? John Furman. Don't read this because you cannot read it. It's in creation. But it says rejection as an incentive, right? So this is one of the books that one of my mentors gave me. And he said, like, look, have you ever been rejected by girl? By girl? I said, yeah, of course. Have you ever, after that rejection, stopped approaching other girls? I said, no, right? <laughs> I was like, either I was finding a way to get to this girl or I moved to the next one, right? So it was, he said like, yeah, find an incentive in that rejection and go for it, right? Uh, always, always do it. Like always go, go for what you want. And if you don't, somebody else is going to get it, right? So it's not that like, People say, well, you cannot make money in cryptocurrency. You cannot make money in, 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 in network marketing, in online business, in affiliate marketing. Yeah, you can, right? Why? Because we already see that there are people making 100K, 1 million per month, 50K per month, 10K per month. If they can achieve it, they probably found some way to do it, right? So let's say if you are new to the business, I got to tell you, you will be rejected. You will be rejected a lot. It only depends on the goal you have in front of you, your why, who will take you across that rejection, across that line. So let me tell you this. You will be rejected mainly by your family and your friends. So that is your comfort zone. You're thinking to yourself, I just started a business and... I will go to my best friend, to my family, and they will immediately say yes. Wrong. Completely wrong. I'm telling you. That is completely wrong. That is the same thing happened to me and all the people around me, which I know. So the best business you will make out of your zone of people. So if this is your circle, Okay, your circle. Here you have your friends and family, right? This is the people that you hang out, live with, uh, uh, you know, spend every day, see them often. Well, <clears throat> they like you. They maybe respect you. But they don't see you as some kind of an expert in area you're offering them right now. This is why. Maybe you're working as a waiter. Maybe you're working as a mechanic. Maybe you're working as, as a, um, in, in a grocery store. Maybe you're working as a driver. And suddenly you come to them, approach them and tell them, hey, I got a way how to make us rich, right? But that is the fir first problem. They don't trust you that you can make them rich because you're not rich already. But if you tell them, hey, I have a solution or I met a person, a guy who is already successful and who has a solution for us to come out of the rat race, hamster wheel, to come of the, so, uh, the, the way of life we're living now and to in increase our lifestyle and help us make money and I can get you introduced to him, then that sounds a little bit different, right? Always use a third person to create trust. Because your people trust you, but in other areas of life, they don't trust you or you're not competent enough as a professional to present what do you have to your inner circle of people because they have not seen your success in this already. And that is the biggest problem, the first biggest obstacle, everybody, including me, including all of you who are in this business for years have stumbled upon in the very first beginning. And there, there are ways to deal with this. There are very, very simple ways to deal with this. How to deal with rejection or your closest friends. I will speak about this also 
on our trainings. I will teach you sales. I will teach you how to approach anybody, any stranger, how to approach an Uber driver and get him locked in in two minutes. I, I have done this multiple times and I will show you the same how to do it, right? But for this circle of people, you cannot use yourself. You need to use somebody else, right? That is your mentor or your business partner. In the next training about business, I will speak about the importance of a mentor, right? So there is a second circle where you can make business. Who is that? That are your acquaintances, right? People you have seen now and then, know them through your friends. You know, you meet them at a gym, at the restaurant, at your coffee shop, at, you know, people that you meet around yourself, but people who, that, who don't particularly know what you do in life and stuff like that. So this is, this is the first circle, right? The least business you will make here. This is the second circle, the acquaintances, right? People you, you don't know, you don't associate every week or every day. You will make more business here, right? And the third circle is the circle of strangers. All right? So one big shot for you guys, the most biggest business you'll make is with the strangers. Is with the people who you meet in the elevator. Is the people who you stumble up on completely accidentally. Is the people who you meet in in like in 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 a in a in a, in a coffee shop next, table next to you. Is the people who you meet in, I don't know in in, uh, in in Uber or 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 anything. Is the people who you never met. Is the people who you will meet over social media. If you build your business over social media the exact way which i will also teach you how to build your business over social media once i started building my business over social media i got so many leads i got so many people getting to me approaching me who i never knew in my life these people started following me these people started texting me and seeing that i have something that can potentially shift their life in a way they want but it didn't happen overnight right it happened over time so building your business and the brand over social media is something that we will talk about i think for three four trainings that you need to go through every detail to learn about it because it's not easy but there are rules to do it and once you do it trust me i'm saying that from my own experience if you reach to the people and give them value and show them that you're doing something that can change their life, people will get directly to you. They will reach out to you. They will contact you and they will ask you to show them how you did it, how you help and do the same for them. Okay, right. So we spoke about the last training on why, how, and, and the basics. We spoke about the uh, GoPro uh, book and I hope I really hope you have read that book right so all of you who are on the first training that we had with the BFIC Academy who read the book put a one in the chat while you're putting one in the chat if you read that book if you have not I will put it right do you so you have it because this is very important uh right so let me find this book this is very important it's very important this book is very important right uh let me just find it all right <clears throat> okay i found it good let me get it to you guys in the chat here. So I'm just searching away how to get this book to you. Well, it seems that I don't have. All right. Okay. Um, here's the access. You can get it online. It's in. All right. Okay. Here's the link for the book. All right. 
So download it, read it, or buy it. <clears throat> so the next thing I want to talk about, you have prepared yourself. So you did the necessary steps. You did the contact list, which we spoke about. You prepared how you're going to call the people, how you're going to approach them, right? So now we need to prepare ourselves for what? So in business, this is the most important thing. Your first 90 days, right? So your first 90 days is really, really important. And we're going to do something. We're going to prepare you for something that is called 90 days game run. Okay. So I've been with the Eric Worre. Uh, I've been last three years on all the GoPro um, seminars, uh, which are, yeah, I think, every November. And I've been I've been in his academy, which I paid six thousand dollars for a year, just to have the access to the mentors he has, to the people he's working with, with the mo like top of the top in the network marketing industry. So I paid my way in, right? So I paid my way in and to be able to learn from the people that are making millions in this industry. And this is, I'm going to teach you what I learned from them and how I applied it to my business, right? So 90 days game plan. So I started my network marketing business in 2012 and I was like getting, you know, starting building it. And I was learning, 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 learning. And three years later, in, in my second company, uh, I started, I went to another company and I started a business. And at that point, uh, I, I was out of money, right? So I was making good money. And the company, first, my, my first company, they changed the reward plan. They changed the product and our business went down. So I was searching for another solution, which is uh, decent enough and sustainable to build a business. And I found a company, right? So I started completely from scratch, like from zero, like I was entering the company. And my partner said, hey, we need to do a 90 days game run, right? Not a game plan. We did, we're not, we are planning it on our calls. What we will do is run, right? So uh, because why? I'll tell you one thing, right? So success, number one thing you want to remember is that success loves what? What does success love? Can somebody type in the chat, what does success love? We need to do something very fast, right? Guys, success loves what? Speed, right? Success loves speed. We need to do things fast, right? So everything you want to do, and last time I told on training about your goals, increase them, double them, and then double them, right? I hope you have done that. If you have not done that, go to the last training. So success loves speed. Why are we doing the 90 days game run? Because we want to compress the time, right? So the first time I was entering my 90 days game run, I was out of cash. I was broke. I was completely broke. I did not have money to pour my gas tank to go to the meeting in person. And Zoom was something really new then. That like no, like a very small amount of people knew what Zoom is and how, how to connect to Zoom and online meetings. People were not into online meetings at that point. So there was no webinars very often. We need to do things in person. And I could not pay for the room. I could not like pay for the gas. So I was creative. Like it's not about the problem if you don't have the money. It's about lack of creativity. Uh, and so I, I was creative. I figured out a way how to do it. And three months later, right? So three months later, I, one, one month, I did a warm-up. I, I was preparing. I did a warm-up. We can do a warm-up much shorter. And once I started, so I started climbing up the ladder really fast. So I went 
uh, in my first month in this company, I made like $500, something like that. And the products that I needed to buy, the package of the products that I needed to buy was two and a half thousand dollars. So I was still $2,000 in minus in my first month. I needed to sell the products or use them, you know, to show the results. But this is what happened. I, so I went very fast. I, I, I said, okay, this is what I got, what I want to do. I want to build the business fast. I'm going to teach you how. So once I started doing that, my business went from $500 to $1,300 next month, $5,000 next month. And in, within those three months, so from $500, I went to over $10,000 after my third month. My fourth month, I hit my $10,000. $10, so I hit six, six figures, right? So six months later, I was hitting between fifteen and seventeen thousand dollars $17,000 with selling physical products, like something that people need to buy, take, take for a couple of months to get some kind of result. And, and, and a potentially as a customer say to somebody else. So it took them three months to feel something and show to other people. So I'm telling you, six months later, I was hitting over $15,000 a month. I hit my first six figures only because of this. If I have not done this fast, compressing time, getting, 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 getting it fast, I would not do it. I would not six, hit my six, six figures. That was my first time. And I did this 90 days game run a couple of times. Each time, guys, I hit six figures and over because why? We compressed time frame. We did things fast. So success allowed speed. We can do things or business in two ways. We can do it slow and painful and fast and profitable, right? So success allowed speed, right? So next thing also, what we need to hear is, which I already said, and accelerated burst, okay? We need to be on fire really really on fire if we do want to do something fast we need to fire we fired up like we need to burn burn about it we need to feel it and we got we need to tell everybody what we are doing we are on a mission right so we are on a mission getting fast to something right so if we need to do things fast what do we need need we need speed or velocity we need speed or velocity. We need to speed things up, compress time frames. Also, if we do things fast, what's going to create? What's going to happen if we do things fast? We're going to have what? We're going to have a momentum. Okay. We're going to have a momentum in the business. So we need to create momentum. Momentum is created by acceleration, by speed, velocity. This is how we create momentum. Remember this, guys. Momentum. I'm going to show you this. Solves 80% of your problems right so momentum solves over 80 percent of your problems if you're going slowly you're gonna say well the compensation plan is not good the product is not good oh my god they said they're gonna launch this uh like one month ago they have still not launched this i'm gonna you know put the put the brake on i will not do it but guys if you're momentum like imagine yourself riding in a car so if you're riding a car and if you're like in the road jam, like traffic jam, okay, what are you doing? Like you're behind the wheel, okay? And what are you doing? You're watching left, what's going on, watching right, what's going on, because of what? You don't have anything to do because you're not, you cannot move fast, right? So, but 
if you're driving, let's say 150 on a highway, right? You don't watch left and right that often. Why? Because your eyes are on what's in front of you. Where are you going? You know exactly where you're going. You're going there fast and you're not turning your eyes off because of what? You need to put your eyes on the goal on the on the end on the end where you're going to, right? So momentum solves 80% of your problems, right? I hope, I really, really hope that you guys are writing this down. These are things that I was paying thousands of dollars and spending time on the field, uh, investing into business to learn this. So I hope you're writing this, right? So fifth thing, out of all those things, if we do it, if we do it fast, with velocity, with momentum, speed, it's easier, right? It's easier to do it. The business is easier, right? Okay. What I want you to say to yourself, guys, say to yourself, say this. Say this to yourself. Write it down. I'm ready. Okay. Say to yourself, I'm ready. You need to believe to yourself for yourself that you guys are ready. So say to yourself, I am ready, I'm ready, right? Say to yourself, ready, I'm ready. Type in the chat, I'm ready. Who's ready? Who's ready to run fast and make big, big amounts of money? If you're ready, type in the chat, I'm ready. I'm waiting for you guys. Type in the chat, I'm ready because I want you to participate. I want you to feel your, I want, I want to feel your energy. I want to know if you're ready, right? So. Congratulations, guys in the chat are ready. I'm ready. That's it, guys. You need to feel it in yourself. I am ready. Okay, this is the number one. So next thing, what we will do, we will run hard. Run hard. And along the way, along the way, Along the way, we will learn skills. You cannot learn everything, then go do it, right? Because there's too much stuff to learn for, in order for you to wait. The best thing you're going to learn is by doing it. So everything you learn now in the training, you do it right away. Do it today. Do it tomorrow. Do it every day. Repeat. So repetition. Of all the things you're learning, you need to do the repetition, 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 and then you will know how to do it. But you will do it very fluently. The first time I went on the stage, so in my in my uh, uh, when I started my sales career, it was a direct sales business through insurance, so it was not like a network marketing thing, but it, 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 it's still a sales. So I knew that car I want. So I was aiming for the car. I didn't care about anything else. I, I had a business. Uh, sorry, I had a job. I was working as a waiter. So I had uh, my uh, with my, my family. I had, I was working my family business. Uh, we had a restaurant in, in a coffee bar. So I was doing there. I was working there for a salary. I, I had a job. But I knew with this other thing that I will be able to get that car I want. I was so happy. I was so smiling. This is the thing that's going to help me get this car. And first people I want to talk with is my friends, my 10 friends. You know what I said? You're an idiot. You cannot make money with this. They, you cannot make this money. You cannot earn that car. You're stupid. Go work somewhere else, blah, blah, blah. So I was very disappointed. So I was disappointed because my friends said that I'm an idiot because I believe that somebody else is fooling me that I will make money. And I told them, hey guys, I will get you all insured. You will all have life insurance. And they were laughing to me. I, uh, it, it's never going to happen. Like, no, right, no. So I met a lady. She was my mom's friend. And I told her, hey, how would you like to do this with me? And I said to her, if you will help me, 
get all these 10 friends, 10 of my friends insured. So they will have a life insurance policy. I will give you half of my commission. How's that? She said, no problem. And we made a plan and she intentionally called all 10 of them to their parents and stuff like that. In about eight months later, I was not saying anything to them. So they are making fun of me. I was carrying a, a suitcase and they're making fun of me. And eight months later, she got them all 10 insured. I took a copy of their life insurance policy and I called them, all 10 of them, sent them in a bar and they were drinking beer. And I said, hey guys, what's this? And I just showed them their life, uh, life insurance policies. They, they said like, oh my God, you did this like, oh, we didn't. So they were very surprised because I found a way. I said like, this is with me, but here's the thing. You did not trust me. And that's the first thing that I told you. So they will not trust you that you can do it. They trusted the lady who was 45 years old. They were 19. They trusted her, but they did not trust me, right? So find a way, find other person, find a mentor, find your business partner or, or somebody in your team that has a common interest to do it instead of you for your people, right? So, okay, so uh, what, what you need to do is uh, starting starting with this 90, 90 day uh, run, you need to create your story, right? So we, we, we will work on creating your story. I don't know you guys, I don't know who you are, but you have a story to tell, trust me, right? So getting, working on your story. So become a storyteller, right? So what you will become here, what we want you to become is storyteller. We are in the storytelling business. This is not sales, right? Sales is storytelling. If you if you ever bought an Apple iPhone, you didn't buy <coughs> iPhone, <coughs> excuse me, because of the specs, maybe. Maybe some other phone has better specs, but you bought it because it brings a story with it, right? If you bought some car, it has some story with it. If you ever bought something in life, every commercial you've seen, it's it, they have a story around it. Any marketing you, you've seen, they have a story around. So you need to become a storyteller. You have a story to tell. Trust me. You are the one who has a story to tell. And I want you to create your story. And this is how you're going to create your story, right? Okay. There's, there's three stages of your storytelling, okay? Three stages of your storytelling. It is before, now, after. Let's take a weight losing company. So let's take a company who has weight losing products. So you've seen the pictures, right? So you've seen the picture. There's a picture, and somebody said this picture here, right? So it says before and after, right? So we see somebody who is like this, bam, bam, right? And we later see somebody who is like this, right? Okay, so he is he is thinner, he lost weight. So this is before, this is after. And what is in between is now, right? So maybe he is still a person like this. But what he is saying, hey, I've been using these products for a month, two, three months. And I lost, I don't know, 30, 20, 30 kilos or 10 kilos, five. And, and this is, so I saw that people are making success with this, what I'm trying to lose. I'm trying to look better, healthier, fitter, whatever. So I'm trying, I'm using this product that can help me get here. Right now, I did this amount of result and it's getting me here. This is what I want to become, this, this person here. And if you have this problem, if they're overweight or have uh, problems with weight, you tell them, hey, this can help you too, right? So just a 
classic example of everything you already know in life. You know, companies like this, right? So with, with, with cryptocurrencies or with trading or with network marketing, right? You also need to create your story. What can be your story, okay? So your story can be before. So before, address, in your story of before, address to the problem you had, right? So address the problem, okay? Address to your problem. You say, I had a financial problem that I was lacking $200, 500 $300, uh, $1,000 per month to help me uh, to help me in my life to have money for this, 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 right? You, you count what is that for you. So what you will do over this weekend, I want you to take a piece of paper, take a notebook and guys, create your story, right? So we need to do a preparation for this. I will go through all the details. We will not have time for all this today. So we will do it next training. This is a little, this. These are the series of trainings. Go through this training. Also make sure you send this training to your people, right? So the problem which you have, what is your problem? What what What's bothering you in a financial term, in a life term? Find, find something that is bothering you right now or you are having fight with because it's not getting you where you want. So you need to list it. This is now, this is like copywriting. Now we are creating your story because your story will determine you how you will address to other people. Okay, so now, where are you now? Okay, now you say what you are getting from, you know? So what are you getting from? Well, so, uh, So we say, what do you already gain? Okay. So there, there will be some gains by joining a company or using a product. Okay. And after that, so what is after? After that is the number one thing we spoke about here and is your goal. So if you don't have your goals written down, and if you don't know how to say somebody what's bothering you, you will not sell them. They will not become a part of your team. They will not join your business. They will not do anything with you because you don't know where are you going. That's what we spoke about in last training session. You need to know where are you are going. People will trust you if you know this, okay? So you need to know this. The best thing about this, you know how much time you need to explain them this. Not 15 minutes, not 10 minutes, not five minutes. You need one to one and a half minute. That is maximum. One minute should be maximum to explain your story. So what I want you to do right now, after we finish the training over this, over these next two days, create your story. Take pen and a paper. Start writing down. Like, like a person who's writing a book, okay? Write it down, read it, write it down again, read it, reread, 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 re uh, edit, edit, edit. Talk to your story to your mentor, okay? So make your story, write it down, read it at least 10 times for yourself and think about, put yourself in other, other person's shoes and think about if you tell them this story, Will they get interested? Okay. So once you have that ready, then only then you call your upline, your mentor, and tell them your story and read them your story. Tell them your story like with a heart, like not, not just read it. Tell it with a heart, right? So once you tell them to your with your heart, ask them for their opinion. What do you need to improve in your story? We're not gonna lie here, but we need to create, modify how you will present yourself towards other people, which I started this training with, is with what? With telling a story. Storytellers, trust me, storytellers are the people who make the most money in this industry. Not, you know, if you're selling a technical spe specifications, you will never buy somebody 
with technical specifications. You will buy something if you like it, if you see the vision of their product. So always keep an eye on the vision and what is behind something you're buying, okay? So what we will do with this 90-day plan, okay? <clears throat> what you'll do, right? Not just me, what you'll do. We will divide it, okay? We will divide it in 30, 60, and 90 days, right? So you will make plan for one month, two months, and three months, okay? So also, this one I believe is really, really important, really important. And this is... Sacrifice, guys. If you're not willing to put it in the sacrifice of your time, of your money, of, of time with your family, you will not be successful. Each success in this 90 days game plan requires sacrifice, right? I'm not telling you this will be easy. This will not be easy to do it. But if you do it, after that, after 90 days, your business, your life will become easier. Trust me, I have seen it. So either you will sacrifice, I don't know what, okay? So you can sacrifice what? Time, right? Time, money, okay? What else can you sacrifice? Sorry for my bad writing. <laughs> Time, money, right? Okay, so what? Gaming. So if you're a gamer, maybe gaming. Uh, if you are a football fan and like to go watch the football every night, football, right? Okay. You are watching movies every night. You will sacrifice movies, right? Okay. So bar, bar, going for beer with the friends. For a friend's call you and you go each time they call you, fail, right? Because this is the time, all this time, okay, gaming, football, movies, bar. This is the time you can invest into your business, into getting your success in the next level. And if you are watching a movie, you can watch that movie later. But this will, this will make you lose time, right? Okay, so there, uh, there needs to be a sacrifice, okay? Right, so somebody in the chat is saying devotion to your duty is not a sacrifice, it is the proof of your existence in the world. This is true, my friend. This is very, very true. Okay, so <clears throat> we need to put in one more thing, and that needs to be intensity. Right, you need to be very intense in what you're doing, in where you are going. So if all of your friends know that you have been a little bit obsessed, right? So I'm telling you, you need to become obsessed, guys. Obsessed. Obsessed with what? With your goals. With where are you going? The person who knows where is he going and where, and if he is going fast there, everybody will move. So if you walk, like crazy fast somebody, somewhere, you, and you know where you're going, you go walking fast, everybody will move from your way. If you don't know where you're going, you're just walking like lost, everybody will hit you in the crowd, will, will turn your way. But if you know where you're going, bam, 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 and fast, everybody will move from your way, okay? So uh, you need to become obsessed with your goal, with what you want in life. People who are obsessed with the success, with what they want, they have made the success, all right? They made the success, okay? Right. Okay, so how to do 90 days game run, okay? How to do it, right? So first thing is, all right. This is very ugly writing. <laughs> Sorry. Is yes, you need to decide. 
decision, right? First thing is your decision. You need to decide, are you going to do it or you're not going to do it? There's not, well, I'm going to try. I'm going to put, I'm going to try it, right? So people who are trying something, uh, there was a Roman empire and, you know, everybody wanted to kill Caesar. So Caesar had a people who will try a food before him so he doesn't get poisoned, right? So you know what happened to the people who are trying something. They did not succeed in life. They probably died, right? So you need to decide you will do it. You will sustain until the end. This is not a decision you want to do because of me or because of any company or because of anything. This is the decision you need to do because of yourself. Right. So this is the decision you're doing for you, for your family, for your goal, for your cause, for your vision, for anything you want to create in life for you guys. This is what you're doing for your life, for your future, not because of me. I don't you don't do anything, anything because of me. Just come to the training because I will teach you how to become successful. <clears throat> Sorry. So the first thing is decision. Second is what we need is. Preparation. We need to prepare ourselves. Like a chef who comes to cook to the restaurant, he needs come to the, come two hours before he chef and and and, and the, the people in the kitchen need to become come two hours before the shifts, before everything the business starts to prepare the salad, the, the side dish, the, the meat, the everything. Do I need to make the preparation? Because once the business starts in the restaurant and they're not prepared, they're done. They will swim. The, 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 the waiters will not put out the food. The guests will say, uh, this restaurant is bad and you will lose business. So if you're not prepared, trust me, you, there's no business, right? So, okay. Once we, you have decided and you prepare everything you need, like what do you need to prepare? Okay. <clears throat> so here's how preparation uh, uh, looks. Okay. I, I will go through all the details, but you need to go become prepared. You need to talk to your people. You need to talk to your family. You need to know what you will do. You need to, uh, so all the details. Okay. I'll go through all of this, right? So, so what we have next is pre-launch. And you can be in the company that is two years old and, and, and you can still do 90 games plan because it's your business. It's not the company's business. It is your business, which you are launching, right? So what we said in the last training, we are not here to build a business. We are here to launch it. And if we launch the business very good, it will build, build by itself, okay? So fourth thing is we can do this like preparation two weeks pre-launch two weeks or three weeks, and then 90 day run, okay? 90 day run, okay? Four thing, 90 day run. Also, when this 90 days is done, we are not stopping. What we said about the training, about the plane, when plane is lifting up, 100% of gas, of pedal to the metal, right? 100% of throttle we're putting in. Once we are up in the air, we use 70% of the throttle, okay? So this is the post 90 days, right? So what we will do after these 90 days, okay? We will not do another 90 days, okay? We will maintain the business okay so we will maintain it right so we'll talk about this in the next training i will do a couple more things but you need to know how to prepare yourself okay so what we need to do right is design designing 90 days Run. So we need to design 
your nine days? How will they look like, right? So first thing uh, you need to know is you cannot talk to the people about everything. You need to choose two of your best products that you will offer. So you need to pick your team. Need to pick your team, what you will do, what and how, right? So you need to stay to two top three things, right? You cannot offer 15, 10 things, 10 products, because it, you're losing your focus, you're dispersing yourself. Pick two to three best products or opportunity you're going to speak about and focus yourself on this. Become a master of this. Everybody in, in your team or in your business will find their team, their topic, what they want to do. Okay. So, <clears throat> first thing what we will need to do or uh, that you need to uh, think about yourself is okay, what is General growth, okay? General growth, what will you do in your business and where will this take your business? So that means in your rank, that means in your numbers, that means it means in the money, the amount of people you're, you're helping, on the amount of people that will uh, <clears throat> uh, join your business and rank up and stuff like that, okay? So next thing is what you need to determine, design is, which will be your new rank. So if you're not ranked in the company, if you don't have any rank, if you're just starting, okay, you need to determine which rank you will go to. So I don't want you to put something that is very easy to hit, all right? So what I said the last time, okay, determine what is the rank you're gonna go to, right? You're gonna speak about this in the next training, exactly in details right we'll determine this i want you over this weekend to think about it because next week we are continuing with this so what is the new rank you will do hi guys uh, guys do a homework so during the next three days you need to design this put this on your paper i want to see you putting this on paper get this recording today to your teams let them put it on the paper Prepare yourselves because we are about to rock, right? Okay, so third thing is if you, uh, for example, if you are getting to the new rank uh, or if you've been on some rank and you went down of this rank, okay, well, let's see if you were requalified. This is not worth for new people, but if you've been, on a particular rank and you fell down, you lost some people or they went, you know, uh, you didn't do, do the qualification and you fell down, requalify, right? So requalify for the next rank. We're gonna do it in details next time, okay? Requalify, right? <clears throat> okay, so also design that you will what? Stop crawling. Stop crawling. You need to go fast and we need to do things in order. So determine what rank or requalification you will make and stop crawling. Stop, you know, uh, uh, putting, uh, if, if you have people who are in your business and they're not doing the business and they're not starting and you ask them, hey, we have, like, we are preparing 90 days game plan. Let's launch it. Let's do it. Blah, blah, blah. And they're saying, oh, well, I'm not prepared right now. Cut it. Cut it right away, right? Cut them right away and find new people. Because trust me, you will always find new people who want to do it, right? And, right, do it again, right? So you will always find new people who want to run with you, who want to do it, who want to... Uh, 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 go the next mile with you and go with those people. Go with the people who are willing
to go out there with you. Find those people, call people in your team. So also design everything what we said here. Next thing, call your people in your team, send them the recording, tell them, hey, this is what we are doing. Or you do the training for them, for your team, like I just did for you and tell them we are preparing things. Are you with me or you're not? I am running for the next 90 days. I am prepared. I am doing this. Are you willing to go out there with me? Lock arms and I'll help you do it. Get your people ready. We're about to launch, right? So <clears throat> that is it. That is this for the, today's training. We will continue on creating this story also. Uh, uh, we, we will continue the next training on creating the story. We will continue on preparation, pre-launch, launch. We'll go through all the details we in here. Okay, so make sure you are on the next training. We will go through every of these detail, details. You will go and we will teach you how to do this in details. Right now, we are training, then preparing, then re pre-launching, then launching. Okay, so stick with us. Okay, uh, if you don't have the link to the academy, if you don't have the link to YouTube recordings, uh, we will send it, <clears throat> excuse me, over again. Uh, and we will see you the next training. Uh, Mr. Jack and Gear, can you please uh, send the link for the training for the YouTube channel? I see some people. Okay, thank you. Some people are saying here that it's not working, right? I hope it is working for you right now, guys. Okay. Uh, so uh, let me know in the chat. Have you learned something from today's training? How, how you feel about today's training? Um, we're just going through the chat, right? Somebody is sales manager in life insurance in Pakistan. Uh, well, uh, sir, I, I, I believe that uh, you know what I was speaking about and what was going on. Uh, probably you went through the same story, all right? So yeah, preparing yourself, bring you with intending Clint for linking, liking your time. Having chat with you and having business with you, yeah. Preparation is really is really working. Okay, preparation, right? Okay, guys, in the chat you have the links to everything. Who to to, to uh, go through the last trainings? Okay. Also, if you have not read the book, the book is called GoPro, yeah. right? I do. Uh, the link you yes. sent for the book, and that link is not working. Okay. 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 Sorry. One second. One second. It should work, right? This link should YouTube work. Link is working fine. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. One second, please. <clears throat> Okay, I'm going to send you the official page of Eric Lorik. And yeah, official page of Eric Lorik. So you go, uh, just type in, in Google, guys, type in GoPro Eric Lorik. I just type in the chat and you can find the book online, right? read this book this book is really valuable this book has helped me to build a business and if there wasn't for this book i would still be you know uh, uh hustling and 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 you know struggling and learning learning some things that i learned very fast here through this book so go find this book online get it for yourself get it for your teams make them read it if they want to work with you uh, when I work in network marketing, this is how I do it. With a new person, All I right. send them the book. I have it in PDF, right? You can find it online in PDF. I send them the book and I tell them, this is what you need to read in the next three to four days if you want to work with me. If no, I will find somebody else. That's it. Once they read it, we start going through all the topics of the book and we start working mainly through this book on the business, okay? So... Thank you for today's call. Uh, thank you for attending it. Uh, we will do the next trainings also. 
make sure you follow the BFIC Academy uh, social media links. They announce on their Instagram, on their TikTok. They announce all the trainings. So you come to our training and we will help you learn the skills of sales, crypto, uh, marketing, uh, trading in order for you to make money. Thank you for today's call. Mr. Jack and Gear, back to you. Okay, great. That was, that was a very energetic session today and uh, you're looking in good form today. You recovered well. <laughs> so thank you, Mr. Devo, for today's session. It was a very wonderful session. I really enjoyed it. And I hope our team members also enjoyed it because it was very different. It was very motivational as well. And this is the basics of uh, starting any business. This is the preparation which you need to do. So this is like the work which you need to do prior to starting our business. So guys, we're just getting warmer to start uh, to teach you how to start your business. So please go through all these uh, sessions. You can. Uh, I, I, I hope you have uh, made the points to uh, you know, noted, noted all these uh, uh, charts which uh, Mr. Deva was uh, sharing you. Uh, and I hope you have taken screenshots because they are very useful. You need to find and set your goals and then you need to decide. Then we will help you as well and how we can uh, select your business, which niche you can work upon and a lot of many things you can do. But this is the basic of any business. So guys, I hope you are motivated and uh, let's hope to see you in the next session. So thank you so much for running today's session and I'll see you in the next session. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mr. Devo. Thank you guys. Have a great day. Have a great weekend.